Hello everybody, Chris here, and this video is going to be about the briefest of introductions to LibreOffice Calc. Now, if you have ever used Microsoft Excel, this is like the free version of uh, basically my Microsoft Office Excel. And what LibreOffice Calc uh, does for you is it stores a bunch of information that you type in into these fields called cells. And that's every single square box you see in this document. You can also notice that we can scroll down to hundreds, even thousands of cells. And in terms of columns from left to right, it's labeled alphabetically, uh, going past Z to AA, AB, AC, and so on. Now, with these cells, it's up to us what we're going to put in as far as information goes. But generally, the type of structure that you want to set up within LibreOffice Calc, the reason to use LibreOffice Calc, is when you're trying to make a table, which uh, is a very simplistic but efficient way of organizing information. And then with these different fields, we can type in our information. It's also possible to bring in uh, information from outside sources like a database. Um, and then one of the coolest things is that when we have a bunch of fields like here, let, let me go ahead here and say this is uh, the, the column for January. And then maybe on day one, it was five dollars made, then three dollars made, then six dollars made, so on and so forth, is that you can actually run functions taking the information, the data that's stored in other parts of uh, your LibreOffice Calc document run a calculation on them and then give you the output automatically so for instance the simplest version of that would be a sum and you can uh, access sum right over here on this toolbar the functions toolbar i believe it's called we'll hit the button there and uh, libreoffice is pretty smart so it's gonna figure out that the thing that we want to sum is probably the information right above it so it's going to sum cells from b3 to b5 um, once again, noting that it's column first to the letter and then the, uh, the row number, so B3, B4, B5, and it's going to spit out the final calculation there. So I'm going to hit enter right here, and there we go, $14. And even better is that we can change the information in the other uh, cells, and this calculation, this function, uh, will spit out the corrected result. So that's just one really cool way you can use LibreOffice Calc. There's a lot more that goes into it, a lot more functions, and a lot more ways to style your tables and style your Calc documents. So if you're interested in that, go ahead, subscribe to my channel. I'll be coming out with a bunch of these videos in the near future. So thank you for watching. I've been Chris. If you found this video helpful, consider checking out my Patreon. And until my next video, I'll see you then.